Today's been our official opening day um, to celebrate all the hard work that's been done up until now to get us to the point where the building is now officially open. We've got the team in place now to start running some real projects and really to celebrate all that hard work and also to look towards the future. Robotics and AI is far reaching, there's many ways that can help society and the economy, so from drones that can do inspection of wind farms to help with net zero, to robots in our home helping people with accessibility issues. So that's what really excites me is the potential of robotics to really help society um, and do good for all. We're going to be working very closely with industrial partners Alongside that we're going to be trying to encourage and promote more research into robotics and AI and alongside that we're going to try and help uh, people understand what robotics and AI can do for them. It brings together two of the world's great universities, University of Edinburgh and Harriet Watt, and that academic excellence is what underpins all of the operational work that we're doing here. It's looking at how we get robots out of the lab and into the real world and bringing that to interesting application areas. We'll be bringing industry and academic institutions from all around the world to work on problems that are universal across the globe and we will be deriving solutions for those challenges that will be adopted hopefully um, everywhere and help all sorts of societies going forward. Across the UK we're targeting innovation in a big way um, and it's really important that different parts of the United Kingdom whether that's in academia, in, in industry, uh, and across governments as well, is all, that all needs to come together to make sure we get the absolute most of that. And of course, this is a, an area that uh, doesn't just lend itself to uh, improving society and industry here in the UK, but we could really be seen as a centre of excellence from around the whole world. And this is a perfect example of that. I was absolutely blown away by the facilities and the kind of engagement that is already being undertaken within the facility. We are very excited to be participating with and engaging with the National Repertorium and hope to be able to bring some of our customer challenges to uh, you know, solve in this particular facility and uh, we are really looking forward to the partnership. The ambition really is to start to make an impact on the economy and start to see some jobs, start to see some new businesses and over the next few years be in a position to be very proud of having got all of those things off the ground. What we're doing here is looking at operational excellence. How do we deploy and bring the technologies to market? How do we deliver impact? So how do we take new technologies, combine those together to produce systems that have capabilities that we haven't yet seen in the robotics space? I think that's somewhere where we're going to get a lot of traction moving forwards and it cements our position as a world centre of excellence in robotics.